Hello everyone. I'd like to share with you a few trades posted on Monday 26th of September by our graduate students and global instructors. This clip is from Easy, who's trading the US 500, which is CFT of S&P 500 futures contract. And as you see, the macro 30 minute chart is in downtrend. And we are in kind of sideways and trying to retest the lower end of support area. You can see that in five minute charts as a downtrend channel uh, similar to this, uh, which has gained momentum. And in one minute chart, uh, he was able to draw the trading channel and find uh, completion of pullback in the uh, overbought area, which is the ALGO 4 and risk to reward ratio, which is ALGO 5 and enter here uh, with these positions to position one here and then the pullback was complex and he entered again in another position without touching the stop loss two positions and uh, based on the risk management uh, he chose the exit strategy number one and exited in the middle of the channel as you see uh, we have two exit here that's the uh, area that he gained uh, high probability uh, win rate with risk to reward, which is around one or higher. So thanks, Easy, for sharing your trades with us. Uh, the next trade is shared by MH, uh, who's shorting the DAX uh, CFT futures. And as you see here, you see the downtrend channel on the structural and macro charts uh, because the pullback got completed. Uh, on the uptrend channel and then that was a good area to enter here short position uh, that is aligned with the structural chart and macro chart so as you see enter one position here and exit here another one also here uh, two positions and exit with profit uh, in this area of the channel so the channel is gaining momentum slowly and he entered when the price reached significant amount of profit one time here and one time here. Uh, so thanks so much for sharing your trades with us. Uh, these are a few trades that I took uh, earlier at the beginning of New York market when uh, volatility calmed down and I had time to check there was a downtrend here that I took multiple positions and here there was long position that I took. There was kind of pullback, deep pullback that had one quick potential for fastest scalp. So after that, I'm waiting for retest and then going short if this gets rejected and the channel goes down. As you see here, I went back and see the channel broke. So I'm taking short position. Volatility is high at this time. You see the shape of candle is not good in one minute charts and also in five minute charts. So just one single position quick as called to wrap it up for the day. And let's see what happened. I'm actively managing position. Uh, so putting the profit target around the previous level of support it should go down after retesting in this very a small time frame 10 second in this very in this very with one push, it can reach the target. Okay, reach that. So that was good for the day. And uh, although it was choppy, as you see, uh, let me draw it on the charts. So this was the channel that was trading only long because it was uptrend till it broke. And from here, it, the volatility increased and it became much more choppy and unpredictable so in this area was good and trendy 
as you see on one minute charts but this area was really not good and became choppy so that's reason I stopped for the day thanks for your attention and hope these trades are useful for you and have a wonderful day